Okay guys, uh, spatula games, spatula coming at ya. Uh, we are epilogue 2, Red Dead Redemption 2, and I'm just milling around. I don't know what I'm doing, so let's find out. Uh, there is a cougar over here. This is the reason I started recording. Where'd he go? Come at me, bro! John, John. <laughs> what kind of nonsense was that? He would not aim. He wouldn't aim. What's wrong with you, John? <laughs> okay, that was uh, pretty messy. But we got some big game meat, so there you go. Which is what I'm doing right now. I'm hunting because John basically doesn't have that much. Uh, let's see. So I was looking through my inventory... And I have some watches. Cougar Fang, big game me. I have some of this stuff from Arthur, but not all of it. So I like you can see I'm short on food. Tonics. Ingredients. I could I could go see the fence. But see here I have all of the uh, trinkets. Yes, I do have some things for crafting. Okay. Whoa, 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 whoa. you mister I tried you saved my life I'm going to be on my way now I'm never okay. coming back Skinner brothers <clears throat> oh that's a stranger Skinner brother Come here, Hoss. All right, don't. You're a good girl now. There you go. Nope, nope. Yep. Generally don't want to use an improved on these, but uh, I'm only er interested in the don't meat. Worry, girl. Okay. Aha, uh -huh, new one. Prairie Poppy.
Okay. More raspberries. I guess I probably have this, but let's take a look anyway. Let's get one. I don't know what it's worth. Okay. is the nearest trapper. Okay, he's up there. How far is that? That's not too far. Hello, sir. Hold on. Receive mail. No. Oh, no. I had all of these collected as Arthur. Every one of them. No. I had them all collected ahead of time so I wouldn't have to do this. And I have to do it. All right, so we'll get them. Wow. What a rip off. There we go. Great. You gotta help me, Mr. Abel Stucks. Been wanting us to sign our land over. Only this time they, I escaped, but they, they I had my this husband. One. They're gonna kill him. Abel Stucks, huh? Where are they? It's the stone farmhouse back there where I came from. I'll see if okay. I'm finding more help. I got this. I got this. There it is. You don't sign this over. 
I'm gonna take a long time on you. They're killers! Get them! Get them, Joey! Oh, you... Hey! Untie me, will you? Okay. Oh, yes. Thank you. Thank you. Those goddamn bastards deserve that and more. My wife. You see my wife by any chance? Yeah. Yeah, I saw her. West of here. She told me to come find you. Oh. Oh, thank God. But thank you for hearing her call. What is it? Okay, I didn't mean to pick that up, but... Dollar <clears throat> fifty? Guess that's it. Didn't really need that Litchfield, I don't believe. But I have it now. Alright, now, where's the uh, trapper I was heading to? There he is. Let's go. Look out. That up here? Take a look at it. Yep. Don't really need those anymore. Doing business with you. Okay. Uh nothing quite like wearing your best day's work. I don't have that much money. All right, we're going to wait on that. I'll wait till I get some money. Thank you, sir. Okay, so the brothers are back here. This is one of the things I forgot to do with Arthur. Isn't it? Yes. a silly boy. And Protus isn't a boy at all, but a chimpanzee that a man shaves a face into every day. Now that's very useful. You can't punch, my sweet. It's sad, really. Oh my, our friend. Hello? I bet you can punch. Do me and the that's lady right. a favor here, would you? And thrash this impudent wretch. Thrash? No man alive can thrash me. What was your name, sir? John. John could. Easily. You. Maybe, but not me. I know. Punch us both as hard as you can. You'll break his glass jaw, and I'll be left standing with a knife and the name. Good idea. Hit me, then. Dear boy, give the feeble fellow a little tap and watch him crumble. Uh... <laughs> you really walloped him. Right, yikes! <laughs> I'm fine. Ooh, look there! I got a proper chin! Not God. like that toe rag. Good lord above! Doesn't hurt. 
Hey, hey, hit me again. again. Right here. Right here. That might have killed a lesser man. Free shot. Oh. To the solar Aren't plexus. You never to hit girls. Punch a man for once. Give me your worst. Here I. Oops. Oh. I think he's done for. Barely even felt it. <laughs> There's only one thing for it then. Hit me in the manhood. Don't worry, sir. Miner made a. <laughs> <laughs> They've come out his ears. Nobody ever asks for this. Enough, gentlemen. Yes, I think so. Oh, I slipped, and I hope you killed the leprechaun. But he's still alive. Shoot him, please, one of you. There, there, up you get. We need to get some steak on those wounds. Madam, gentlemen. Good luck to you. <laughs> Whatever no got kidding. in your heads? <sighs> Let's just follow them for a minute. Morning. Morning to you. There she is. They're heading for the hotel. Fellers broke through. One e was shooting all over the place. What's Here's that? the hotel. Morning. We're almost there. You have your fun with these boys. Now let me look after them. Oh. She's gonna look after them. Okay. Welcome. Now lie down and rest. They all three go to the same room. Yes. Rest. Much better. A few moments of sleep and then I'll have the beating of that boob. Hush, boys. Now hush. That's it. Go to sleep. It will all be better in the morning. Sleep it off. Okay, sleep, she says. And we still have this guy. Nope, it's locked. All right, so that's enough of the brothers right now. I gotta pick up some coffee. Great. Thanks. You believe this? Hey Oops. there, sir. Haven't seen you in here before. No, I'm you sure haven't. you need a good meal after all the traveling you do. Why don't you grab some meat and cheese on my counter here? Now, let me just look in here. Provisions. Ninety cents. Enjoy. Can't have too much coffee. All right. I think that's really all I need for now. <clears throat> I'm glad that's fixed. Me too. Okay. Let's see Sadie and make some money here. I thought I told you to leave it, Bubba. And I thought to myself, who this little girl thinks she's telling anything to? Uh, enjoy your drink in peace. <laughs> I ain't got no business with you right That's now. That's right. What that mean? For the last This guy time, with the hat on. Leave me alone. Is the one that was there with Arthur and Lenny. <laughs> He just got punched in the face. Get the hell out of here before she kills us all. You, you, get out of here. 
matter of fact, I think I drowned Von that guy. Marston. It is good to see you. <laughs> I thought I heard a rumor you was alive. Jim Milton, that you? That's right. Guess I didn't do a real good job of hiding my identity. <laughs> we didn't hear nothing about you. You, you killed a feller up by Roanoke? Sure did. I thought that sounded like you and Abigail and Jack. She? She's fine. <laughs> she was always so kind to me. I'm looking to buy yep. some property. Beecher's Hope, west of Blackwater. I'm kind of a farmer now. <laughs> and you? Oh, you know how it is. Bounties mostly and some other stuff, good and bad. Hey, you any interest in bounties? No. Uh, sure. I've gone straight. Huh? Sort of. Oh, it's legal. I'm usually. Then, maybe. Come on, then. What? Where are we headed? Strawberry. John's wearing the shirt got that Abigail got York. him. Good price for him. What'd he do? Rob a bank. With a gun? No, with a pan. He's an accountant, I think. Sounds easy. Come on, we got a bit of a ride. I know. All right. Your telegram. You said you had something to discuss. I didn't think we'd be chasing down an outlaw. There's something else. What? Micah. Micah. I think so. I heard of someone sounded like him uh, about a year back. Okay. We always said if we found him. I know what we said we'd do. That ain't changed. I didn't nope. think I'd see any of you again after you left for the Yukon. Now we came back. Didn't strike it rich, as you can see. But you're a rancher now. I got Uncle with me. We'll be okay. Uncle? Well, getting a scalp by that gang out there might be preferable than living with him. Sometimes Probably. I think the same. Strawberry, where every good accountant hangs out. Looking to sell your wares or buy some of the finest meat right. ever grazed. See what you can find. Like I said, the fellow's name is Nathan Kirk, banker, bald, forty-five. Okay, say, I mean to meet my friend in town, but I don't know where he's staying. Bald New Yorker, Nathan Kirk. You know where he is? Afraid I don't know. This guy got me in trouble the last time. Excuse me, friend. I'm looking for a Nathan Kirk, fellow from New York. Got any mail for him? Kirk? Kirk? No, not so as I would remember. Curly, I think. Oh, she's a woman. <laughs> Ask in the Welcome Center. Most tourists check in there. Okay. All right. Thank you. Whoa. Oh, turn around. I know. Now. You, uh, you seen a fella? A fella from New York? Bald guy? Yeah. A few New Yorkers come here in search of the West. This one's a wanted man. I work for the government. Uh, s s sort of. His name's Nathan Kirk. Mr. Kirk? But yep. he's so charming. Is he staying here? He's, uh, up in room three. I'm gonna go pay him a visit. It's government business. How exciting. 
All right, let's pay him a visit. We know how this is gonna go. <laughs> He's gonna run away. Mr. Kirk! <clears throat> Mr. Kirk, you in there? Who is it? It's just a friend. <gasps> Stop! Hey! That's Nathan Kirk! Oh! Got him! Oh, shut up! Let's go. Come on, jump on! Jump. Out. Go over. We gotta get after him! Remember, I'm going. we want him alive, though! I know! I see that. Stay on him. I'll catch you. Trying. Where are you going? Shit. Oh boy. That's right. I don't deserve this treatment. You're lame with a rope. Deserves got nothing to do with it. Thanks for that, Mr. Kirk. Real fun. I'm an innocent man, but it's all a mistake. My wife, my wife is a is a desperate woman. How you buried, sir? None of your business, woman. All right. I am. <clears throat> she made me do it. She broke me. I did bad, but I'm not bad. There is a difference. Where shall I send the money? I ain't been paid yet. Send it on my behalf to West Elizabeth Cooperative Bank in Blackwater. Pay down my loans. Might make them happy to see I've got a boss. You know, right. I've got a couple of other leads I could use your help with if you're interested. I'm a saloon in Blackwater. I need money pretty bad, so. I'll come find you. There it is. Sixty dollars. Hmm. Okay. So there's the Sadie mission, uh, and then only one left, I think, is Uncle. Yep. Oh, there's a bounty. Time is it? There is a bounty. Let's go make some money. John needs some money. Let's go, girl. Oh, partner. You after a bounty? I can tell. If so, we got a poster on the wall just there. Ain't that good news. Bart Cavanaugh. Well, well. Ooh, a Laramie. Bart Cavanaugh of Laramie is wanted dead or alive. That's the way I like it. Bart Cavanaugh has been declared an outlaw in the province of Strawberry. It has been definitely ascertained that Cavanaugh is guilty of multiple accounts of ass assault, intimidation, and the wanton destruction of property. Gnarly Rock. All right. Bart Cavanaugh. He's one of them boys down from Laramie. They say they businessmen chasing up land deals, but I know higher guns when I see him. Right. Laramie. I'm acquainted with some of those fellas. Oh yeah, yeah we killed a lot strange of them. Strange tolerance, but this one's gone too far. He's up north of here, the other side of the mountain. Good luck with it. All right. Okay, Missy.
Is that him? Hmm. It doesn't say. goes you picked the wrong bounty my friend keep still and oh. shut up It is now. Don't know who you think I am, but I ain't done nothing. Oh, I can't wait to kill you. You're a good silly. <laughs> All right, let's go. Release me, you son of a bitch. What kind of coward ambushes a feller in his sleep? Thanks for making it so easy for me. Wish that That's was right. all as dumb as you. Oh, my stomach's turned something rotten. Can you take it easy? Nope. I really don't feel good. And I really couldn't care less. I think I'm going to be sick. <coughs> spill any of your guts on my horse. I'll spill yours on the ground. There you go. I'm just as fine taking you in dead. True. That's better. That's enough out of you. Oh, God, no. This boot's wet. Oh, shut up. <laughs> They're going to attack at some point. There's usually some stragglers. But we're almost there. We are there. <clears throat> See how much money we get on this one. Come on, don't do this. Let's work something out. Oh, we're working it out. To hang you right up there. <clears throat> Someone's here to see you, Sheriff. <coughs> Bart Cavanaugh. Put him down in one of the cells. You know who okay. I am, Sheriff? You know who's protecting me? I hope you're sweating, because you're going to feel it for this. It's your boss who got you brought in, you dumb bollock. Now shut up. There we go. This is the worst mistake you ever made. Let's get our money. My 
Honey's there. I'm gonna take some comfort in seeing at least one of them Laramie boys meet justice. Take it if it helps you sleep at night, shit. Thanks. Sixty-six dollars. Posters up on this wall makes the visitors nervous. I'm told. Okay. Well, there's a little bit of money. Two hundred and ten. Uh, we could go check the doctor's office. Uh, let's see. There's a guy. Ooh. Don't know if I want to do that. The store owner here has got a little uh, moonshining operation going too. But I don't know where this is going to put me, but I think I'm going to end it right there. Um, we did a Sadie mission. We did a bounty. Uh, did a little bit of hunting. So we're just getting started here with John in Epilogue 2. There's a lot more to do, and I will see you in the next one.